The tramway is one of the most important inventions of the second half of 19th century. It changed a lot of people in the 20th century. The English professor Leonard Delft was one of those whose work led to imagines and spread of the tramway. In 1883, it built an electric railway in New Jersey, USA. By his transport, his railway tracks led for a horse. Between the tracks, there was an additional rail insulated from the earth. Voltage from motor car engine supply was applied to it. The principal of operation is thus closer to the modern subway train. Wheels and shafts were isolated from the wells, thereby avoiding a short circuit between them. Shafts electromagnets that were formed by coils placed next to the driving wells were used for braking. Whenever it was necessary to reduce speed, the wire from the body was lowered on the main track. The passing electromagnetic current forced wheels to brake. The Duff system for his car, called Ampere, weighed about 200 pounds and carried four people, including the driver. As the supply voltage in the engine was low, it would drive in high humidity conditions without the danger of short circuit. Duff system cars were used for some time in New Jersey and then Los Angeles, although they didn't become widely popular due to small capacity, but they were the first examples of electric rail in America.